Respect. Not your genuine love. Respect page. I should appreciate your time to the genuine ones only. Protect your energy because not everybody's ever going to get time. Have a safe day. Have a safe remainder week. Protect your energy. Domestic violence is something not to play with. It's something not to manipulate and think it's funny. Because when there's something about domestic violence, it's funny. When someone is being manipulated, brainwashed, hurt, traumatized, it continues to go more form, beyond form, gone. When you know, you know. When you try to like you watch a freedom, it's a thought process for me. It doesn't matter what sex orientation you are at the end of the day. Male, female, you put a name to your book. Stop the violence. Stop the hate crime. Stop the jealousy. Stop the envious energy. There's no, re no, no need for it. Lo true love is not supposed to hurt. True love is not supposed to make you feel unworthy of yourself or make you feel like someone's supposed to control you because that's not true love. And someone allowing you to feel like controlling you was part of the plan, that was never part of God's plan. That's nothing but the enemy. And I say that respectfully. Someone putting their hands on you, that's not true love. They say why. Return back to the abuser. It's a thought process for me. You know, when someone is not used to someone showing them compassion and love, yeah, you may think it's slow and stupid. Whatever you want to put a name to that bug judging them before you even know what's really going on. You know, when someone doesn't know what love looks like up close in person, they will go into the hands of somebody that's preying on them and know they can get away with something. It's a thought process for me. Making them feel like that's love when it's in love. Remember, if you don't know what love is, someone's showing you compassion. Before they start controlling you, that's all you remember. Then you think that's love. That's not love. That's lust. That's disrespect. That's someone trying to psych you out your throat parts, love on your freedom, your eyes, and your pockets. It's thought parts for me. How they sit there and play you close to know to pray on you at the end of the day because they know that you're vulnerable. Oh, they sit there, have private conversations amongst you, saying to you, tell me about your past. Who's in your life? Oh, that's how they use it against you. When they know you don't have family, or even if you do have family, they don't want you around your folks. It's a thought process for me. So they can't control the narrative of your life. It'd be a thought process for me. How people sit here and quick to play in your face. And the whole entire time, they're not even in tune with you. They just want to use you and abuse you. Because that's what they're so in tune with. That's what gets their adrenaline running at the end of the day. And that's toxic and disgusting. It's a thought process for me. How people don't matter what sexual orientation you are at the end of the day. Male, female, put a name to it. You, you'd be so surprised. They don't got to be gay or whatever you want to put a name to your buck at the end of the day. Straight. I'm just saying. It don't matter. A abuser is abuser. Some with a hand problem. So disgusting. Within a disgusting. Every situation you get in, you got a hand problem. It's a thought process for me. That means you have a problem. I can understand if you did something once and never did it again because you had to reevaluate your thought process. That's what you saw growing up and that wasn't the win. It's a thought process for me saying sorry and meant what you say and saying what you meant that you were truly sorry for what you did and that wasn't true. It's a thought process for me when a real one actually reevaluates the thought process and say to themselves is, hold on, this was not part of the plan. It's a thought process for me. You know how when you're trying to elevate and become your best self vision of yourself, they try to distract you with the distract you, lying on you, saying that you put your hands on them when you really didn't at the end of the day? It'd be the thought process for me. Then you sitting there at the priest and reevaluating your thought process, saying to yourself, to yourself, saying to yourself is, I just have malicious intentions because I didn't like that person today. Then you have real life situations where someone's trying to get out of a situation and they can't get help today. It be the thought process for me. Hold it up time, what are you doing? Wasting someone's energy, what are you doing? When they need to save someone's life today. It be the thought process for me. 
answering bogus phone calls than bogus phone calls. It'd be a thought process for me where you have innocent people out here that need help. You hear your neighbor screaming for help. You're not going to call 9910 to see if they need help. Just say for safety first. You wouldn't want nothing to happen to your neighbor, would you? Regardless of the day you mind your business, yeah, do so. But still be part of the plan and help your neighbor. You ain't got to go knock on your neighbor's door, but help your neighbor. Because your neighbor's screaming out for help. Everybody using this cold word, mind your business, mind your business, but ain't nobody fixing the problem. It be the thought process for me. Why it's going on so long? What's been going on for so, so long? It be the thought process for me. Why is the fact that a man can put his hands on a female? It be the thought process for me. Hey, female, female, you can't beat everybody. It be the thought process for me. Like, people really got the game messed up at the end of the day. You putting your hands on somebody because you got a hand problem. When the enemy told you that was the norm, that was never a part of God's plan. That was enemies talking. It be the thought process for me. Domestic violence, violence, hate crime. God did not install that within us. God installed respect within us. You have the good God and you have the bad God. I dance with the good God. The good God that shows you that there are better days ahead. The good God that is real. And the good God that is here. The good God that's about to show you at the end of the day. Who you are today. Because Judgment's Day's been here. Respectfully. God is real and God is here. Get it together. Respectfully. Get it together. God is not too happy with a lot of people. And I say that respectfully. God is not too happy with a lot of people. Men saying they're men, pointing their chest out at females, putting their hands on females. Why, ma'am, sir? Violence, hate crime against each other. Why? God doesn't understand why. But y'all gonna find out. <laughs> Because God is real. God is real. God is real. God is real. If you knew better, you'd do better. Stop overlooking your neighbor because you don't understand what your neighbor's going through. Sometimes someone done put some spell work on someone for them to be in that, in that, in that delusion of someone's delusion. Someone then ate something bad that was a, a spell. And you'd be so surprised why that person is in that delusion. Protect your energy because not everybody is deserving of your time. They would sit here and manipulate you, brainwash you. You know how that feels for someone to try to brainwash you? Because they want to control you. It's a part two to this video. I truly appreciate your time to the genuine ones only. Protect your energy, because not everybody's having your time. True love doesn't have a hand problem. True love is not disrespecting each other with words that, 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 that starts a, a violence. That's not true love, no. That's not true love. You're hurting each other to a point where it's so disrespectful that blood is being drawn and People are leave, leave, leaving with knots in their faces and knots on their heads and biting each other. And, and, and that's not love. That is definitely not God love. That's not God's love. No. But God is real. God didn't create toxic love. God created healthy, peaceful, joyful, happiness. Love, genuine compassion, love. I appreciate your time to the genuine ones only. Protect your energy because not everybody's ever your time. God is real. God is real. God is real. And God is here. Protect your energy. Not your genuine love, respect. Wow. Stop the violence against each other. Stop it. Stop. God is here. God is real.